Hello friends. It's been two years and I'm still chubby. But anyway, I just thought I'd bring you guys along on my next idea. Insert husband eye roll. <laughs> um, here we have, you know, an aching with for, oh, two years. Um, I wouldn't say nothing. I mean, we, we grow grass hay here and we feed it to the goats. Um, but, you know, I have, <laughs> um, and I want to plant some flower bulbs and maybe see if I can get into a little, you know, flower farm, um, vegetable farm type thing for selling up at our farm stand. And also, um, we started a, me and my sisters opened a thrift store and I think we're going to put a farm stand up there over the summer too. Has lots of traffic. I think it could do well. So that's the plan. Um, last year I just planted sush here in this little plant that's already, our little spot that's already worked up. So today, you know, last minute, I, um, I ordered 250, um, daffodil bulbs and 250 tulip bulbs, both just mixed varieties, last minute, literally the day before the ground is going to freeze, um, tomorrow and forever, just December 15th, so this is pretty late for Wisconsin, but, um, starting tomorrow, it's going to be cold you know, for the next four months. So literally today is my last day. It rained like an inch overnight. Um, so last day to put these in the ground, they came yesterday from Holland Bulbs. Like I said, I just, they had a great deal. I got these 500 bulbs for a hundred bucks, which I don't think is too bad. Um, I think if I, if they actually grow and, uh, you know, I can make some maybe Mother's Day bouquets um, in the spring, you know, I'll be able to make a little bit and just kind of start getting in the rhythm of what I'm doing because I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> so um, I thought it was a um, low cost idea and uh, I'm going to do that today. So yeah, I kind of can, our house is up there. We kind of have this middle portion where I have my chicken addiction here, ducks, little barn. We have a couple pot belly pigs and goats if you scroll back to some of my other videos. And then this is all fenced off um, for this back pasture, which is a good acre or so. So I'm hoping to take at least a half of this acre um, and literally just go down this whole way with rows of vegetables and flowers this year. See how it goes. I'm excited about it. Um, like I said, I think I can, you know, maybe get something going. I know that a lot of things aren't profitable in the first couple of years. Um, you know, I'm giving, I'm getting old and I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to live my best life before I keel over. So, um, <laughs> so morbid. Yeah, I got the, I got the ranger out here. We got our bulbs. Well, and some garbage I took out of the barn, but, um, yeah, these are the tulip bulbs. Just a mix variety. Um, I'm going to plant these, um, you know, flower garden style, which is pretty much, they call it egg carton, um, an egg carton style. So pretty much right next to each other. So those are all the tulips, tulip bulbs. Ugh. I'm so excited. I feel so official because I got a crate and, you know, you see all the flower farmers with like the crates. So, uh, it's kind of official now. Um, but yeah, and then we have the daffodil bulbs that look fantastic so i'm excited to give get this a whirl um and i am gonna get these started into the ground so you all can watch me uh, struggle if you want enjoy
Okay, so here's where our tulips were. I just covered them in dirt. Now I have our daffodil bed all done. Almost died, but I didn't, so I gotta continue. Um, these bulbs are quite a bit bigger, so we'll see if this day is gonna be. And we're back. Phone went dead. Shocking, I know. So, I finished up the daffodil bulbs after some investigating. It looks like I did not plant them quite right, but we'll see how they <laughs> come up. Um, looks like daffodils should have a good three to six inches in between the bulbs. Um, mine probably have two. So, we'll see how they come up in the spring. I'm not going to dig them up at this point. Um, I can always dig up the bulbs after next spring and replant them, give them a little bit more room. So I might do that, um, but I'll turn the phone around here. So yeah, tulips here, daffodils here, and we'll see comes up in the spring. Um, I'm excited to see, hopefully, hopefully something. Thanks for tuning in. Um, I'm just out gathering eggs. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks. Bye.